But first, a Mercer County man who killed his girlfriend is sentenced to 18 years in prison. Good evening. I'm Katie Houston. And I'm Mark Allen. It is a case that really shook the small town of Rockford back in November. It was the first homicide there ever. Daniel Martin shot and killed Melinda Shin in their home. Alexa Ashwell takes us inside the courtroom where Martin learned his fate. It's our top story at 530. It was an emotional day here inside Mercer County's court. Prosecutors tell me they hope this will bring the family of Melinda Shin some closure. But they tell me this is just the beginning of their fight to keep Daniel Martin in prison. Daniel Martin apologizes to the family of Melinda Shin before a judge sentences him to 18 years in prison for her murder. 15 years to life imprisonment. Plus three more years because a gun was used in the crime. The judge quickly passes down this sentence after listening to about an hour of testimony, most from Shin's family, who wore pins with Melinda's picture. Her son's statement was read aloud first. He wasn't in court, but there when the shooting happened. I'm 10 years old, and I miss my mom so much. We did everything together. It is heartbreaking now when I look at my son and realize. I can't do the things that Mindy did for him. She could walk into any room and lighten it up with her smile. And that Brayden has the same smile. So when she sees her grandson, she sees... Martin shows little reaction, but at one point his brother also apologizes to Shin's family and addresses his own. My nieces and nephews, your father did a terrible thing. But I'm going to take you guys to your head. The end of sentencing brought a flood of emotions. Martin's children, tearful. Melinda's family, sad, a little relieved, but unable to accept his apology. I don't believe he was remorseful or sincere in his apology. I'm glad that it is, he's going to prison, but it will never be over. She's gone, but she'll never be forgotten. Her memory will live on. Alexa Ashwell, 2 News, working for you.